Hello video family, this is Tish. Welcome to Lose Weight Now TV. However, this is not a weight loss video. This has to do with hair. I was very concerned about my hair thinning around here. Um, this is part three of a three part series of hair. This is going to cover things that I have found that work. My, I was worried about my hair coming out, not only the thinning part, but it was also, a lot of it was coming out when I was combing it. Um, so I was like, I need to do something, right? So I've been doing stuff for about three months. The first thing, okay, I had dandruff. Shoot, I didn't bring it. I had dandruff, itchy, dry scalp, um, you know. So I love QVC. I watch QVC. And the Wynn man, Chaz Dean Wynn, whatever his name is, Wynn, was on. And I was like, okay, I'm going to try. So I got the tea tree one. I have the oil. Actually, this is just the bottle. So that's when the tea tree. I believe that worked. I saw really good results. Um, it really tingles. The key with the Wynn, because I'm not trying to be racist, but... You see he mostly has white women using, you know, when you see, if you watch the 30-minute commercial with Alyssa Milano, mostly everyone's white, and then there's a couple of black women. Um, but whatever, the key to using when is you really have to use a lot of it. When I had it, when I had it, <laughs> I'm sorry, when I could afford it. Um, I was using 40 pumps. I would part my hair down the middle, use 20 on one side, 20 on the other. I did notice a difference. And then I bought this package thing. It came with the conditioning, the cleansing conditioner, this oil, and a hair mask thing. I don't care for the hair mask thing. Maybe I'm not using it right. I don't know. Whatever. I stopped using that. But I did use the tea tree oil. Um, when I ran out of that, I just went to Trader Joe's and got their tea tree oil um, for this is less than six dollars and I have a dropper and I just use the dropper I just drop it around here I go down the middle I go like this and massage it in and I go around the edge of the back of my hair um, and I'll explain why I that I just have that by itself okay Hair growth serums, hair growth formulas, recipes, whatever. Um, at the end of this video and in the link, the description box, I'll put a link to the young lady. I'm pretty sure her name is Miss Bossy Live. She makes a formula. She doesn't sell it. You can see people in the comments put, if, if I send you some money, will you make it for me? She does not do that. Um, but so I followed her thing and I made it. And that's what's in here now. And I've been using it. I don't know if you can see. It's about half. No. Nope, a little more than half. It's just a bunch of oils. Um, but also she buys sulfur off the internet. And she puts it in there with that. Castor oil. Um, she had something called emu oil. Which I never heard of. I, I didn't even use that. I just used. What I had to go buy almond oil, but that wasn't expensive. Coconut oil. I might have even put some olive oil in there, but the thing about olive oil, lots of women, or I've seen lots of videos where people use olive oil and grapeseed oil, but the molecular structure of those other oils can be too big for some people's hair to absorb. So it's really not, you're not getting the benefits. Um, so, coconut oil has a smaller molecular structure and the hair is better able to absorb it. Which, plus, olive oil smells so bad. Um, the grapeseed oil is, uh, I'm still a little on the fence about using that or not. But I love coconut oil. I have coconut oil. So, um, and then also, I put this in there. Ojan. Um, damage reverse. Um... And I was using this, but I stopped using it because prior to me doing my research, when I learned, one thing I learned if you didn't watch the other videos is that if you start a hair growth, um, 
regime, I don't know what, what you call it. You have to stick with it for a long time because hair will grow. Like I said in the other video, I have really long hair, but this hair has been with me for four or five years. Now I have new hair growing that's only been here two months. So you have to keep up with whatever you're doing to see the results. And um, every two months is a good time to do measurements, right? Okay, that's from that other video. So, um, I found a new way to wash hair um, with shampoo, right? Shampoo is drying. Even if you get like the sulfate-free sulfate ones, it's very drying. So, what I learned from YouTube was only wash your scalp area. Just put the shampoo. Well, A, use a sulfate-free sulfate shampoo. And then just wash your scalp because that's where the oil and the sweat and everything sits anyway. And then when you rinse it out, hold the hair like this or, you know, away. And when you rinse it out, it goes through the rest of your hair just by the process of rinsing it out, right? Did that. I've been doing that. I've noticed less hairs coming out. Um, and the only, only shampoo I use is head and shoulders. Good old head and shoulders. Um... And I use the one that is the conditioner and the shampoo together, right? So to get the conditioning, the moisturizing. But that's the only shampoo I use now. And I just wash the scalp, you know, and um, that's that. So I believe that's helping with the amount of hair that's falling out. Um, so after that, you want to use, you can use a good conditioner, you know, since I can't afford the win right now, I found this Giovanni is a, you know, cruelty-free, um, you know, one of those no sulfates, no parabens. Actually, I think this did have, yeah, no, it's USDA certified organic, no animal byproducts, and cruelty-free, no all the stuff that's bad. I can't even say that, right? So, um, I like this. I was already using their leave-in conditioner. Now, this is the Tea Tree Triple Treat Invigorating Triple Threat? No, Triple Treat. Okay, Invigorating Conditioner. I like that. I have dry hair. If you're a person who has oily hair, look for them. They have like 11 different formulations of conditioner, so I know they have one for you. Um, the other thing that I went back to, I went back to two things from high school. Because think about, I'm like, when I was younger, I had really thick hair. and But I used to wash it, condition, deep condition, curl it, you know. I used to really spend time on my hair. And now I don't. I just put it up, right? But so I went back to mane and tail, the, just the conditioner. And I'll put this in. Um, matter of fact, I'm going to put it in my hair tonight and just... Right before I go to bed, I'm just going to put a little bit, maybe a quarter size in my hand, and just put it on this part, um, of, you know, the dead part of the hair, the really dry part that needs to be conditioned. And I went back to Infusium, Infusium 23, that liquid, you know, when your hair is wet, spray that in there. I went back to using that, and I'm seeing the results. I like the results. Um, I wash my hair maybe once a week. Sometimes, three times a week, it depends on, like this summer, I was washing my hair a lot because I was exercising, sweating, um, and, you know, so that will depend, but the more you handle your hair, the more of it is going to come out, so the idea is to handle it gently and really keep it moisturized and conditioned, and I think that is everything I wanted to share that I have been doing for two months and I'm seeing results which my results are new hair growing here less hair here and um, the hair is more moist it's not as dry and I'm happy so I wanted to do this little video series to share my results with you and um, it's I'm you know like I said I'm over 40 so I try I'm trying to find people on YouTube that are over 40 that do clothes you know 
dress because I don't know how to match stuff together. I don't know what's appropriate, you know, now that I'm down to a size 14 and fall's coming, I'm going to have to buy like a whole new wardrobe. And I don't know how to dress. I mean, if I dress the way I want to dress, <laughs> I'd be in a t-shirt and jeans every day, all day, right? But, you know, I'm an adult, so I'm like, maybe I should dress like an adult now. But, um, yeah, so I wanted to put this together because I know there's women who are having the same issues. I see people on the street. You could not listen to this if you don't want to now. Um... I see people on the street and I'll say, hey, your hair is really thick, you know, what do you do? Or I'll see women and, and I'll go, hey, you know, I notice your hair is thin. They have the same same issue. They wear their hair back and they notice, and you know, I'll just ask them questions. And so um, that's just me. That's how I am. But yeah, okay, thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful. I hope you don't feel like you wasted your time watching these videos. And if you have any questions or suggestions... Put them below. Give me one to three days to respond. And, um, yeah. If, if you want to see more stuff, you could go to my blog and I'll have a link in the description box. And um, thanks for watching. Bless and be blessed. And tune in next time.